Matt Moley. Uh, major decision today, Matt. Senior day. What's it mean to you to be able to wrestle all, all the years and your family get to see you go out like that? Um, it feels pretty good to um, have my family out here, especially everybody came out to watch. But um, would have liked to got a pin or a tech fall, but um, I feel like the guy kind of tried to keep me not from scoring so many points and um, kind of slowed me down a little bit, so I didn't really get to finish it out how I'd like to, but still came out with a victory. All right, you're a two-time All-American. Okay, you got five le weeks left, you know, before the EWL is here. What's the focus for Matt Moley and the Bloomsbury Huskies between here and the EWL? Um, basically, just as a team to stay confident. Um, we've been having some issues lately and dealing with some adversity, but um, basically just to stay confident and um, to push it hard for these last couple of weeks and get ready for the EWL as a national tournament. Okay, you are the definition of a grinder in my book. You just, you, you, you pummel guys, you, you just really wear guys out, and then you just beat them up. Like last week against WVU, you just beat the guy up and then eventually pinned him, you know, towards the end of the match. Where does that grinding mentality come from? Um, I mean, it started out probably in high school. I was always taught to, like, use my shape, and because um, I never really had the best technique, but um, basically just use your shape and just really wear on guys, and when you feel them getting tired, just to smell blood and keep going after them. Small blood in the water? Like yeah, a shark, exactly, huh? Yep. All right, uh, these guys, your coaches, man, they're absolute. When I talk to them, they are, they're really intense guys. They like that grind. You embrace it, okay? Do you think that there, you might have some uh, resistance right now from the younger guys? Um, yeah, a little bit. I mean, it seemed like in the beginning of the year, the younger guys were really fighting real hard, and then towards the middle and the end, like towards now, they, it's almost like they're, starting to realize their backups and kind of um, not going as hard like, as they could. Yeah, like settling for being a backup rather than trying to push yourself real hard to make it to where they're a starter, you know what I mean? Like, but uh, they're just not, it seems like they haven't been fighting as hard as they were in the beginning. Because um, they've kind of settled with that, yeah, I'm a, you know, yeah, I'm not going to wrestle, I'm red shirting or I'm, yeah. you know. I mean, it's a long season, so I understand where they're coming from, where it's hard to just, it's almost like we, Took the they took a back seat and they're okay with it, huh? Yeah, kind of. And that doesn't that hurts the starters, huh? Yeah, a little bit. But um, all the seniors, we had to talk with the guys. Last week we had a day off after West Virginia, and um, we got everybody together and talked to them and all. And I think everybody's refocused and back on track, so ready to make this last push. All right. Do you foresee? I know you foresee a run at the title this year in March. What is next for Matt Moley after that, or can't you see after that? Um. Right Do you now, not look that far ahead? No, I'm just looking for a national tournament and getting into the finals. All right, Matt, you got anything else for me? Uh, no, that's it. All right, hey, thanks for the time. Good luck. See you in March. All right, thank you.